If you don't send an email invitation and then just share your URL that is this link right here and they try to access the meeting through it, then you have to accept or deny the entry for those users. So let's say, for example, you copy this out and send the meeting link to someone else. Someone else will then uh, click on ask to join. So they will have to ask to join the meeting. And what happens is that you get a notification. So it says someone is trying to join and close the dialogue to see who it is. It's like this. So you can see that someone named Pratik Pradhan, that is my account itself, is trying to join the meeting. So you have to deny that you can deny the entry or admit that person. So this uh, random person with the link won't be able to join the meeting. So you can deny the entry and what happens is that the other person is not able to join the meeting. They can send a request again so they can uh, click on the link again and ask to join the meeting again. And if I were to accept it, they will be inside the meeting. And you when you're uh, trying to join someone else's meeting, then it works the same. So now uh, I'm going to request for joining uh, in the meeting with that ID again, my other ID. So I'm just going to click on ask to join and you get this again. So if you were to admit that person, what happens is that now the other person is there just like that. So now they got the entry just like that and you are able to work around with them. So that is how you can accept or deny entry uh, of users. Uh, inside of meeting in Google Meet meeting. So hope you guys enjoyed uh, learning as always. And as always, please like, comment, share and subscribe.